Hey guys, I hope you're all well. Welcome back to my YouTube channel and another H&M haul. I'm obsessed with H&M this winter and just, to be honest, over some wars too, I just feel like in the last couple of years they've just really stepped up their game and definitely become one of my like go-to stores and I know that you guys love them too so obviously I have to share the love when I buy something. Um, so I'm going to show you everything I got but before I get into it I just wanted to let you know that everything will be linked in the description below. There's like a little arrow pointing down and if you click on that I'll link everything and I will put the size that I got and then I'll also write all the information about myself in terms of like the size I normally am and the size I um the height I am stuff because obviously I um you might need that information to pick what size and I wear I like oversized things as you can tell I'll link this jumper below too by the way it's a bit itchy but it's worth it like and when you're wearing your t-shirt and stuff underneath like you can't feel it on the arms so it's fine um but yes so I'll link everything below um and also just FYI like my usual size is size H10 um but I am pregnant so like like the trousers would still fit me but like not do it kind of thing so yeah that's not why i've got stuff in large which i have because i get stuff in large anyway but just like you know you might want to know that information um anyway so first thing i got pretty sure this is a jumper dress pretty sure yes and it's so cozy and actually we've just uh about to go into another lockdown in the uk so all of this knitwear is just like cozy at home vibes that I need um so this is like actually quite thick um compared to like the other jumper dresses that I've got uh, and it's like quite a thick knit so it's actually I'm really glad I got this because I thought it's going to be quite similar so I was a bit like am I repeating my wardrobe but I'm not uh, and I don't actually have a cream one either which is shocking because I wear a lot of cream and I just thought for winter like jumper dress is going to be my go-to because the only trousers that I can fit now are my cashmere joggers like I just named Dr. Cashmere there <laughs> and my Spanx leggings they're literally the only trousers that fit me at the moment I we went out for a fancy meal last night and I was like I'm gonna have to wear my leggings because I don't know what else to wear um so yeah this is gonna be really handy so love that so I'm just showing this jumper dress with my leggings on because my legs are so pasty right now. But I love this jumper part of it from up here. Love the high neck, love how cozy it is, love everything about it. The colour, I'm obsessed. But I just feel like the shape of it, if I put my hands out, can you see like here, this kind of lump? I just feel like it's not the greatest quality uh, and that wouldn't bother me if it was just that but it actually hits exactly where my knees are so I feel like it's a weird length on me because of my height I'm five foot seven so if you're taller or shorter it probably would look great on you but I feel like it needs to either be just above the knee or just like below the knee but it's like literally hitting right in the center of my knee so I feel like it's a no-go for me and I, I've got quite a few <laughs> cream jumpers in here like cream pieces of knitwear because it's like my weakness, like my, what's the word? My Achilles heel in fashion is cream jumpers. Um, so this one, I literally am obsessed with it. So I've kind of got something kind of similar from last year, um, but it's way chunkier and it's really fluffy and big and it's got a zip down front and it's just a bit like extra and it's a really nice jumper, but it's not very good for wearing under things and also you can't wear certain materials aka leggings because the fluff just gets covered um, and this one was a bit more affordable because the other one was like mohair or something uh, and it's like a rib knit and it's cream they do do it in like a really nice forest green colour too um, and I just was like do you know what I don't actually have anything like that which is rare that I can say about a cream jumper um, so I just thought it was a good one to kind of have so this is the jumper on and I'm actually obsessed with the neckline it's so so beautiful but <laughs> I've got my maternity jeans on and it doesn't cover the thing like I keep I'm gonna end up having do you know what I mean like I think it would look best like this um and I can't wear things like that right now <laughs> these literally remind me of like toddler jeans um but yes so that's how I think it would look best um and, and I just can't so I, I feel like it's not doing it as full justice like this just pulled it down um so yeah Unfortunately, I think this is going to be a no for me, but I'm really sad because I'm literally obsessed with this neckline. It's so pretty. I'm tempted to keep it for next winter, but I just know me. Um, 
so there's just no point. So my next cream jumper, I'm just showing you all the cream things at first to get my shame out of the way. So this one, I feel like I probably do have something similar, but I don't actually have one. You want to shut the door? Mm. You always interrupt my videos. You're just desperate to be part of my YouTube channel. Try it. Just obviously, it's not going to hurt your hair. If my hair gets sucked up by this, it's like a thing, uh, isn't it? Okay, enough. Jack, I'm trying to work. <laughs> Don't put it on extra. <laughs> See if you can give it. Oh, no, oh wait, can you straighten it? <laughs> so, <laughs> back to the video. Um, so I don't actually have like a cable knit jumper. Um, and I love this one. It looks so wintry and just like, so it's like a simple jumper. Let me just put my phone on silent. Um, and I just think it's so, it's such a like a, a winter wardrobe staple. I got the long grey version because I was like, I don't want to um, get another cream jumper. And then I was like, okay, I definitely do want to get another cream jumper. So, um, but it's a bit cropped, so I'll have to see how it fits on me with my prego belly because cropped things, it's not cropped, sorry, it's like short, but the cr it's going to be cropped on me. So this is a cable knit jumper on. And I've got it on with my maternity jeans, which I will also link below because they are a very good pair. Um, and it's actually, I feel like it, it is meant to be worn like, like a bit higher. Do you know what I mean? Like this. But I can pull it down and it doesn't look weird. Um, so I'm going to try it on with my leggings and stuff before I decide 100% if I'm going to keep it or not. But I just love the pattern and I feel like it is a wardrobe staple. Like this kind of timeless. It's very wintry, like a Christmas jumper without being too like feral Christmas vibes. Um, it really reminds me of, I know I'm talking a lot about Dumb and Dumber in this video, or maybe I haven't yet when I'm, you're watching this. Anyway, um, but it really reminds me of like, you know when they're like sat in the lodge having hot chocolate? Um, I don't know why, it just might, really reminds me of that. But yeah, I really like this. So I think I'm probably gonna keep this. So I just tried it on with leggings and I actually think it looks really cute. Um, I'm not sure about the crotch showing, but I feel like I'm gonna have to get used to this. And at home, like it doesn't bother me at all. And like when I'm out, I would have a coat on. So I feel like it's fine. Um, and I think it'll look nice with jogging and stuff too. Uh, but yeah, I, I think this is quite a cute little outfit actually. Okay, the next thing I got was a jumper and this is just like, a, it's basically a knitwear haul. This is just like a really simple, casual roll neck jumper. I'm loving a roll neck. It's not as soft as I would have liked, but I am kind of a knitwear snob right now because I have just got my cashmere from Arquette, which I will do uh, Arquette and Anthem Story Tour ASAP because I need to show you what I got from them. But I feel like I've been living in my cashmere set and so I'm like, oh, this is very soft. But obviously it's because it's not cashmere and the cashmere stuff is like over a hundred pounds. So there is a difference in price. I think this is around 25 pounds. Um, let's just all ignore Penelope having a tantrum downstairs. Um, and I really like this color. It's kind of like a <sighs> muted forest green. I don't know, I just thought it was really nice. And it was like, the visual merchandise online with like all the creeds and I just I was like, oh, these tones just go so nice together. Just thinking like this with my leggings, like cause it's a long jumper and then like a nice cream coat. Mm, perfect. So this is a green jumper and I literally love the colour and I actually really like the neck as well and how high it is. It's actually really comfortable too and I love the boxy shape but I'm feeling like the length, it just looks a bit weird here. And I know that the cream one was shorter too, but I don't know, there's just something about this one that I'm not sure looks right. And obviously if I had a pair of jeans, it would look great. Um, but I'm just thinking like with leggings, which is my only option, it's not great. But maybe with joggers or something I could wear. So I'm kind of like on the fence of this one. I think I need to try it on with a few different options. But um, I do really love the colour. So I think maybe if I try it on with like my grey joggers and like my maternity jeans, though I feel like they come to here too. Um, or like, yeah, just like different options. Um, then I feel like maybe it will be a yes, but I'm on the fence at the moment, just purely because I don't know what I would wear it with. Then I literally, another 
Another weakness of mine is cardigans in any form, which you guys know, because even all through the year in summer I was getting my cardigans too. Um, and this one, honestly, I just saw it and was like, I don't know, it's kind of called grey green on the website. So I, I'd say it's more of a grey, but I can see there's like a green undertone to it. Um, now, I don't know how I feel about this one because it is quite clunky, but it's like a long cardigan. So I just thought it was kind of like a smart dressing gown vibes and also i really like long cardigans like just open and i just thought like even with something like this um or maybe like the cream roll neck um with like my leggings again and then this open would just look really nice and like i love layering knitwear together um so i thought maybe like a good option for like a coat or like a layer in between the coat um or just like around the house with like my leggings like done up or something just like loungewear vibes but like feeling a bit more dressed up so i've just popped it on with this cardigan on with the jumper underneath uh like i said for kind of knit on knit look um but i do feel like it looks very um i don't know if it just looks bulky because i'm bulky <laughs> if it looks bulky because of the jumper like maybe i need like a a um thinner jumper underneath um, but I do really like it. I feel like it would look nice with a jumper dress underneath or something. Um, like it is a really nice option for like being super cosy if you don't want to wear a coat. Um, and it's got this nice tie which just kind of looks ridiculous on me because <laughs> of my belly. Like I don't actually know if this, oh no it would do up. Um, but yeah. I just thought it was quite a nice thing for like lounging around in. Then, this is something I've been really excited to come and I've literally been looking at it like, what the hell is that? Like, I didn't order anything back. And I just remembered that it's actually, I realise it's chocolate brown. Um, and I did order something chocolate brown, of course, because it's here. And it's the thing that I've been excited for. Um, it's not the material I thought it was going to be. So it's a roll neck or like a high neck jumper. Um, and it is more of a chocolate brown. I mean, it matches my nails literally perfectly. Um, they do it in grey too, I just really liked it, it's got this really big rib and it kind of goes, you can, I don't know if you can see it so well on the camera but the rib just goes like down and then here for the things, god my hands are a pale, <laughs> um, and it's just like long and cosy, I don't actually own any, I don't think I own anything chocolate brown at the moment, I literally feel like these two are like dumb and dumber. Congeniality. Well, isn't that a good thing? I don't. I think I don't know. <laughs> Penny, did you want to cuddle, mummy? Um, <laughs> dumb. <laughs> She's dumb. You're dumb. <laughs> what? You're so rude. You put me down. You hear my hair? So yeah, I just realised I didn't have anything chocolate brown in my wardrobe, and then. Needed to rectify that. So I actually love this chocolate brown jumper. I feel like I don't know if you can see the colour that well on the camera, but it is like a really nice chocolate brown, um, and it looks so nice with my leggings too, like perfect length. <clears throat> Sorry, and like just yeah, I just feel really comfortable in it. I really like the sleeves. I really like the style. I just don't have anything in this colour. They do have it in grey, as I said, but I actually really like the chocolate brown, and I think it was going to look really nice with like. A neutral outfit um with like all tonal so this is definitely a keeper so far i'm definitely keeping this and the cable knit jumper then last but not least i got this hoodie because so i basically got some joggers which are really similar from and other stories which i will link below um but they do do joggers um on here too um a lot cheaper but obviously different quality um, and I thought this hoodie would go, but I think I'm actually just going to order the matching hoodie from And of Stories because it's better to have like a matching set. So this will probably go back, but I just thought I'd show you it anyway because it's a really nice hoodie. Uh, I got it in large. They are actually really comfy too. Um, I know this, obviously I haven't put it on yet, but I can feel the comfort. But I know this also because I have um, the pale pink set from them from like last, earlier in the year or something. Um, and I wore it loads and it's really comfortable and even after the wash it's really soft as well so highly recommend these and i think they're like 12.99 for the top and 12.99 for the bottom so i'll link the whole set below so 
This is the hoodie and I've got it on with my stories joggers to show you and they are a slightly different colour. This is more of a flat grey whereas this is more of a kind of mild grey. So I will link the joggers and hoodie from stories as well um, in case you guys want to get those instead. But they are quite a bit more expensive obviously. This is £12.99 and I think these are... Well, I can't remember the price, but I think they were on the pricier side for joggers. Um, but yeah, this is it's actually really good length too. I mean, it's not long enough to wear like leggings or something, but it's quite a good length for me. Like covers my bump quite well, um, and it's a nice longer length if you want to wear it like tucked in or untucked. Like I think it would look good either way. I mean, they don't look awful together, but I just I've been thinking about getting the um jumper the hoodie version anyway so i just feel like i don't really have any matching sets so <laughs> i feel like it's better to have a complete matching set it looks more chic like uh with a coat and stuff like a nice outfit uh rather than this doesn't look as pulled together um but i think if i got the trousers to match this it would look just as good it's just the fact that they mismatch if you know what i mean but yeah it's very comfortable and soft and i really like the fit of it and that is everything that I got on my little H&M haul. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Um, let me know what you think I should keep and send back. Though I don't know if I'll be able to send stuff back now because of lockdown. So whoops, I'm going to have to keep it all. Um, but yeah, I love the chocolate brown and the um, collared cream jumper and the cable neck and the jumper dress and the green jumper. Okay, I'm going to keep it all. Um, so thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed it. Do you give this video a thumbs up if you haven't already and make sure you subscribe. I'm already planning my Black Friday content or like Cyber Week content and it's going to be loads. So make sure that you subscribe so that you don't miss that and like hit notifications and all of that good stuff. And I will see you next time. Bye.